A top-level ANC delegation has visited the troubled northwest province. The National Working Committee team included ANC President Siri Ramaphosa, Deputy President David Mabuza and ANC Secretary General Ace Mahashule. Silwane Khachao reports. <laughs> to give marching orders to the newly established ANC Interim Provincial Committee. This is the third provincial structure to be established following the dissolution of the Supra Mahuma Pelu led Provincial Executive Committee almost a year ago. The provincial task team led by Northwest Premier Job Mokoro was dissolved just before the general elections. It was later replaced by what was called an all-inclusive PTT led by NEC members Obed Bapela and Mamuloko Kubayi Ngubani. Their term ended after the elections. Currently, it is only the Ngakamudiri Mulema region out of the four ANC regions in the province that has a regional executive committee. Other regions are led by task teams. Now, the interim committee has been instructed to unify the party. We have uh, put together what we call an interim provincial committee to assist us to rebuild the branches of the ANC, to make sure that there are no double branches, to take the regions that are due for conferences to their conferences and to work towards a provincial conference where we will elect a leadership that will be focused on unifying the ANC. Duarte says since more than half of the Northwest 22 municipalities, as well as a number of provincial government departments, are under administration, a multi pronged approach must be sought to turn things around. Our view is that we need a conversation that talks to how we correct some of the things that have been raised in the Auditor General's reports and by the national government. Primarily, it is about the issue of service delivery. Are we using the uh, I infrastructure grants that we're getting correctly? Uh, the notion of uh, and the reality of corruption in amongst uh, people in the province, dealing with that very decisively. A strong message has also been sent to ANC councillors who vote with opposition parties in motions of no confidence against ANC mayors. If you are an ANC member, you cannot put your hand up and vote with the opposition on a vote of no confidence against the mayor. Let us solve the problem that we have. Let us not deal with our own as the, and we, we join an opposition who is not on our side anyway. The coordinator of the Interim Provincial Committee, Shomani Chauke, says they will also take action against those found to be guilty of misusing public funds, including municipalities that invested public funds at VBS Mutual Bank. We know that uh, public money cannot be invested. Public money is meant to deliver service to the people. And those that are found to have done that, definitely we are not going to leave them. We'll have to deal with that, but we'll have to recover the money. You know, uh, MFA and PFMA are very clear on what you do when there's misuse of public money. Especially regular expenditure, there must be investigation and the action must be taken. And we are going to take action against those who have done that. The NWC has given the Interim Provincial Committee nine months to prepare for the Provincial Elective Conference. In the meantime, NEC members will be deployed to all municipalities to address poor performance. Selwane Khachau, SABC News, Rustenburg.